Okay, this is Project Serpent 16 poles. So I'm working on this project, that's at the starting point. The plan is to have two phase. It's not as smooth as three, but this is what I'm trying to do here. It's going to be a serpent, but it's intertwined. The purpose behind this, so both phases have equal the same amount distance from the magnet. And we'll see how it goes. So, this is Serpent 16, tape step one. So, in order to know the circumference of this, just simply did this. So we drew the magnets and the curvature. See it's over. And use the string. Okay, use the string. Put it all the way around. This is the kind of string we used. A simple string. All the way around. And then I measured the length of the string and divided it by pi. And that will give us the, the um, radius of the circle. So here's this is where it started. This is the second step. The third step is to make the disk. Well, now that I know it's a 16 inch circle, you're going to notice that this is quarter inch right here. So it's a 16 inch circle, but I sandwiched it in between two. Obviously, it has to go through the, uh, the holes. So it'll be sandwiched between the two. And these holes is to see once it goes around, put a tape in there and tape it so it doesn't move on me when I remove it. Very simple. So this video is just to show you the first steps, of how it's going to take place. Second, maybe I'll show you how I'm going to wind it and put the tape in. The third, maybe, you know, how I'm going to form it around this little jig that I've built together and so on. It's going to be fun. Definitely I'm looking forward to uh, uh, see how it's going to end up to be here. But um, let me show you something that I've done already. I have to go get it. Here it is. So these are the two phases. If you notice the two phases, exactly. So when they fall in place, boom, right over. That's the plan. All right, so next one will be the starting point. All this is just the easy stuff to lay out and Definitely is going to be interesting when uh, the language might change a bit, change a bit, use, uh, speak French and all kinds of stuff. Anyway, stay tuned.